Published, 09 Eastern Daylight Saving Time, the 7th of May 2018. Updated, 014 Eastern Daylight Saving Time, the 7th of May 2018. Trump said on the weekend that Washington and Pyongyang had settled on a date and a location for the summit. U.S. President Donald Trump and North Korea's Kim Jong-un are likely to meet in Singapore next month, reports said Monday, as anticipation builds for unprecedented talks between the mercurial leaders. Trump said at the weekend that the two sides had settled on a date and location for the summit, the first between a sitting U.S. president and a North Korean leader, without providing details. We'll be announcing it soon, Trump told reporters. The landmark summit will take place in mid-June, South Korea's Cho's Nilbo Daily reported Monday, citing diplomatic sources who quoted Trump's national security adviser John Bolton. The newspaper suggested that the possibility of Singapore hosting the landmark meeting had increased greatly, after a decision by Trump to host South Korean President Moon Jae-in at the White House later this month, without giving further explanation. Bolton met his South Korean counterpart Chung Yui Young in Washington late last week to discuss plans for both locations, according to local media reports. A similar report on the weekend from South Korea's Yonhap News Agency also said Singapore was firming as the favored location for the summit. Trump had previously suggested that the demilitarized zone between the two Koreas, the site of a recent summit between Kim and Moon, could also be an appropriate venue for his meeting with the North's leader. Other possible sites reportedly include Mongolia and Switzerland. Preparations for the landmark meeting have gained momentum since the Korean summit late last month, which saw Pyongyang and Seoul promise to pursue the complete denuclearization of the peninsula and a formal peace treaty to end the 1950-53 Korean War. North Korea has offered to close its nuclear test site this month, and invited U.S. experts to verify the move. Other less dramatic but notable signs of rapprochement have emerged almost daily, including North Korea moving its clocks forward by 30 minutes early Saturday to match time with the South. Sorry we are not currently accepting comments on this article.